It's the first of its kind on major Saskatchewan highways. A pair of roundabouts are supposed to slow down traffic and make things safer on the soon-to-be-open Highway 46 interchange at Balgoni. Within cities, roundabouts are nothing new. Smaller circles are becoming frequent part of new developments in Saskatoon and Regina with some great results. They seem to be working very well as long as people understand the one rule and that is yield to the inside or yield to the people in the traffic circle, it tends to work quite well. But when you say traffic circles, memories track back to the infamous intersection at Circle Drive and 8th Street in Saskatoon. It was the last major roundabout in the province, and the quirky intersection was the site of hundreds of accidents in the 1970s and 1980s before closing in the mid-80s. Well, I think everything was tried to, you know, to, to uh, ensure that it was safe. But in the end, uh, safety is the most important thing, and the number one thing. And uh, if, if people aren't adapting to it, uh, you know, at some point you just have to maybe rethink that and that's what happened. That was a two-lane roundabout. The new traffic circle at Balgoni is single-laned and Wallace says it should be a safe alternative in a high traffic area. That's something that we don't see very often is, uh, you know, them being implemented on highways and in particular on this particular circumstance. You've really got two of them and what I think they're designed to do is where they intersect with that Trans-Canada Highway, they're designed to, to slow traffic down because it is a circle before they reach the Trans-Canada.